Hello, it is April 5th. I just realized I haven't picked up my camera at all this month. Um, just been busy working ever since the first day of April. Um, my graphic design business has been a little busy, which is actually good for me. It means I have work um, to do and income that is being generated. But yeah, just want to pick up and say hi. This is my one of my new favorite uh, sweatshirts I found at the store called the Lucky Doll. I just open on the app. Around two right now, and I better get, go get my makeup done. Um, I'm about to go to my friend Jordan's going away for party. So yeah, let's go get our makeup done. Hello, look at how cute the kitties are. <laughs> <laughs> Billy, you always gotta squeeze in there, don't you? Oh, oh Bansy, you're such a good brother. And there's Billy. And there's this guy. <laughs> Alright, I think this is the outfit I'm gonna go with today. Just have this cute mock neck top I always layer under things. And have this just like lingerie, not like lingerie, but just kind of like a bodysuit from Tiger Mist. Skirts from Brandy Melville. I had some Michael Kors boots on. Yeah. That's my outfit for the day. I also have my makeup done. Just a really simple peachy look today. On my eyes, I'm wearing the Too Faced Peach Palette. Um, like it's called again, it's just like the original long one. It's like the pink one. Yeah, the pinky peach palette, whatever it's called. On my lips, I'm wearing Tarte Boho layered with, um, I can't remember what it's called, but it's a Desi X Katie. It's a peachy color as well. Uh, <laughs> I'm always rude having stuff or lipstick on my braces. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go brush my teeth now. <laughs> so I'm heading over to Kevin's workplace. Um, then going over to his co-worker's going away party. His co-worker Jordan is like the most adorable person ever. So yeah, I got her a really cute little present. And of course I have a LaCroix in hand. <sighs> and it's like kind of raining, so I'm just speed walking to Kevin's place. Kevin needs some new going out clothes, so that's what we're doing right now. <laughs> if you guys are ever in Bellevue, Washington for some reason, I don't know, you have to try the Looking for Chai. They have really good bubble tea here. It's like a Taiwanese restaurant. It is April. I have no idea what day it is actually. I am about to go work out um, by myself today. Um, I'll have had something to do, so yeah, it's just gonna be me. Well, alright, let's go. Peace. I just have a few boxes here, so. Oh, Belly, don't, don't. I just have a few boxes here, so I. Belly, don't knock the camera over. I have a few boxes here. So I just thought that I'd do a little unboxing on camera. I ordered a few things. I have like stuff from like Forever 21, Sam Edelman, and just Amazon. Um, so just like stuff I'm ordering to hopefully put together a third Coachella outfit. Um, so yeah, let's see how, how it goes. Um, opening my first box right now. I need something sharp to get out with. I placed my camera on Banksy and Belly's toy, and now they're kind of like standing behind the camera and just like looking at the camera screen, which is kind of cute. Um, trying to figure out how to open this without having to get up. Um, usually my nail does the trick, and let's do it in here. Hi, Banksy boy, you want to help mama? Pair of 21 box, it comes with lots of plastic. Um, <laughs> Okay, I bought these like ruby little glasses. Um, hopefully, they don't give me a headache at Coachella. And hopefully, I don't look super stupid in them. But let's see, this is what they look like. <laughs> it's kind of like a Kourtney Kardashian vibe. Um, yeah, see, I can't even see the screen. Kitties, are you guys helping me open my boxes? Do you like these, Daisy? What do you think? No? It's like backing away. You don't like these? 
Do I have plenty of them? Yes, no. Do I keep or no? Okay. Well, I bought this super cute rhinestone cat ear. I'm gonna wear my hair in a high pony on whichever day Ariana Grande is singing and a match of her in a high pony. And so I also got these like, cat ears to wear with it too. Um, that's super cute. This is like five bucks. And I'll probably end up reusing them for like my makeup videos anyways. And I just like bought like a bunch of stuff just cause I needed to make shipping. I bought myself a new shower cap. This one has a, a cute little cat unicorn on it. Um, and I use shower caps a lot just because like I don't wash my hair like every day and I always like want to like keep water out of it too um, Just because I have like really bleached blonde hair that I just don't want to wash my hair every day This is another uh, I'll probably return this. I don't think I bought this with intentions of keeping it It doesn't look as cute in person as it did online, which is just plaid little mini dress. I'll have to try it on and see what it looks like. But this was $17 and it had like a 20% off or 10% off coupon or something like that. But yeah, I hate that all this stuff comes in so much plastic. Why can't we just be environmentally friendly? At least this all goes back into recycling. But yeah, so much plastic. And I mainly ordered not the camera the thing. I mainly ordered this order because I wanted these shorts. They looked super cute um, online. Thanks, see. Can you not use the scratcher when I'm trying to film on it? I guess you're right, it is yours, but <laughs> you're so funny. Okay. I'm gonna show the world your butt. Yeah, I mainly bought it for these shorts and they're just like really cheeky and they have like, I don't know, they're pretty grungy. Yeah, let's see if I can try them on. Make sure you don't chew on these plastics. Make <sighs> see. So, these are the shorts. Um, they're kind of, I don't know, they're kind of diaper-ish. They're a little big. But I wonder if I, oh man, I'm kind of bummed. These don't look as good on me as they do the model. They're pretty loose. I think these will shrink in the wash, maybe? I like that they are like, I don't know, held up in the thoughts, thoughts, thoughts. Okay, let's open my other. This would be cute, but there's like absolutely no way of me like somehow holding it. Yeah, this is going back. I'm returning this. It's... <sighs> I don't know. Ugh. Why is this so hard? Why is Coachella so expensive? Why? Well, actually, I like it because we look for the fashion and uh, the ability to dress up. So that's like the fun part. This is too red for my... But yes. Oh, that's... Oh, my address is there. Sorry, Banksy cats, or I, I don't know anymore. Uh, yeah, these are cute. These are a cute summer shoes. It gives me like a little bit of height, but you know, still deciding on these shorts. What do you guys think? Do I keep or do I not keep? They look kind of funny on me. I, I kind of look like I'm wearing a diaper, but what the hell? Okay, I'm gonna go self tan myself now. Good night. Good morning. I am a mess. <sighs> Not a mess, I just woke up. But it looked like a mess. Slept in my self-tanner last night so you can see my hands are really 
nice and tan. If that would uh, focus. No, it's not gonna focus. But yeah, my face is like really pale. So I'm gonna wash my self tanner off and get my day started. But meanwhile, oh, Blanksy, baby. Oh, he loves this mat. He always lays here in the morning. Oh, baby. Bailey. Yeah, that kitty sleep well with my head. Um, Banksy. He used to as a kitten, and when he grew up, he just stuck around, and so we make a bed for him, and every night he hops up here and he sleeps. Sometimes Belly tries to squeeze in with him, but he kicks Belly off. So usually this is Banksy's spot, but look at how cute she is. Yeah, you go, girl. Queen yourself. <laughs> Gotta really shower now and get ready and then go to skate class. Whoa, what that tongue do? <laughs> okay. So I was gonna do a review of the Estee Lauder um, Double Wear Stay in Place makeup because I bought it for Coachella, but I don't think I'm gonna do that anymore just because I am running out of time and Ulta is close to my skating rink um so if it doesn't work out i can just go exchange it because i need the right foundation shade to match my tan for coachella so yeah let's try it what is this this is a water and silicone based primer okay, let's do it. quickly apply primer darker my body is on my face and then let's see if this works ooh this looks really light now compared to my new tan Yeah, I don't know if that's gonna work. That's really light. I'll just do like a little swatch test. Yeah, that's really light. That's two. Good thing I found that out just now, so. I can go return this and get a the right light shade. So yeah, I'm gonna put this in my pocket. It's coming with me. Okay, so let's just use my handy dandy Clinique. Um, since I'm just using Clinique, I'm just gonna turn off my camera. Uh, or yeah, cause I'm in a rush and I gotta go. Bye bye. <laughs> so it's Tuesday. My kitchen's really messy right now. Funny tan, don't I? Like when I'm tan and I have white hair. Yeah, it's looking a little. It's looking a little funny. Um. So most Tuesdays I'd be running right now, like just like on the run. Um, and I would usually eat a protein cookie, but I'm not really feeling protein cookie right now. Just had a protein bar for dinner last night, so I didn't really feel like eating. So I have some time. I think I'm just gonna make myself some. Do I want? Yeah, it's just an errands day. I have like some like outfits that I bought for Coachella that didn't work out. Then you go return as well. And for my almond butter toast, I like to just. 
put like a little dabble of honey on there. Um, it just makes it slightly sweeter and tasty. And yeah. So both of these are like pretty good substitutes if you're actually like ever craving like cake or something. I literally had a dream last night where I was like dreaming about these like two really good like just Asian cakes. One of them was like a chocolate and the other was like a strawberry. Yeah, so I just woke up craving sweets. I didn't feel like eating a protein cookie. Um, so yeah, toast is a good alternative. Toast with almond butter and honey or toast with like a really good cheese. Don't nuzzle the toast. I've been pretty busy this week too, and just like prepping for Nutella and getting all my clients taken care of before I go. I haven't really had the time to like hang out with cats and like really just give them a bunch of attention. So hopefully, I can get that some in tonight. Um, yeah. And then tomorrow, I'm getting my nails done with Ava. And I'm gonna do one more layer of self tan. Um, I think I'll be set for. Oh, we're good. So back in, in last year, I was still freelancing for this virtual reality company called Pixvana. And they have like a virtual reality solution. It's kind of like, almost like a creative suite for, for like VR and you can like create experiences within it. So one of the projects they did was for this for the Seaborne Cruise Lines, um, there's this luxury cruise line, and they created like a training solution, like a training game to train their wait staff and employees. And it's basically like a map where employees can interact with the map, like move around in it, look and see and learn where the tables and different places are and just really get used to the map because they don't actually get to go on the cruise until like, I think a week or two before like the cruise takes off so I made a lot well not like a lot but okay well I made like the graphics for that interactive experience that's so like super cool like all of like the little icons and like all of the table markers and the navigation and stuff and so the really cool thing is that um, they like recently released it and um, there was an article about it and then a lot of other um, kind of like news thing with bobs and organizations um like other places picked it up and so the article was kind of like booming across the u.s and just like technology news and news and virtual reality that's really cool so i was seeing people like repost it on linkedin or i was just on like on like um just like a news website and i saw the article there and then my graphics are like on display there and so that's super cool um yeah and in May, the experience is going to be displayed in Microsoft Innovation um, stores across the U.S. So yeah, if you're, I don't know, if you have a Microsoft Innovation store near you in May, go check it out. It is just the Seaborn, um, it's Seaborn's like, like just training experience. So yeah, that's super cool. Um, I don't know, it's, it's not like huge, but it's like, it's still something to like, be proud of so I'm super proud of myself for that and that's just so super cool like my name's like not on there because I'm obviously like a contractor for Pixwana but still like seeing my stuff up there it's really cool mm, what time is it okay I have a minute I'm gonna go goodbye okay tripod um forget no, I don't think I need scissors for this I'm pretty good at opening Oop, oh. okay it's all good um so yeah, I'm a little skeptical of ordering plants online and having them be delivered to my house because you never really know like what okay that dress is on the side what goes on in the shipping universe I don't know they might have to manhandle it and might have all like tattered and stuff but the reviews said it was like, really good so let's see moment of truth moment of truth Okay. 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 Okay.
Oh, oh my god, there's a bug. What is that? There's a tiny little bug on here. Yeah, this plan came from Florida. Me, should I tilt you guys down a little? Oh, not that way. I'm still trying to figure out how to use a tripod, guys. How does this work? Okay, that's not the right way. Oh God, okay. Okay, my camera turned off for some reason, I don't know. But here she is, isn't she pretty? Oh, yeah, I'm so excited. I don't know exactly where I'm gonna put her yet. Hoping that I'll have some spot by the window next to the plants, or next to the sofa. But yeah, this, this is her, she's so pretty. The leaves are so healthy, I would never guess that like, you could ship a plant and have it arrive so in such good condition because even if you buy plants from like home De home depot or lowe's you have to like pick through them because a lot of times the leaves are all battered they're not like well maintained or well taken care of but look at this it looks perfect it's so beautiful but yeah excited to have a new plant babies <laughs> and you go buy the side planter too really lady what are you doing He's just like judging her. We and Awa just got our nails done. Show him a twin. Ooh. And now we're at the mall. Trying to vlogger. Trying to get our last pieces for uh, Coachella. Do you want to be on camera? No, no right now. That no. looks so gross. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're at South Center. South Center. We're in the hood. I'm trying to find some cute pieces for Coachella literally the day before we fly out. So, yeah, let's see how that goes. <laughs> Not good. Not good. But yeah, we're going to get some food first because we're starving. Still waiting for a moment, but oh, potato corner. Oh, that's me. That's me. That's me. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good day. You too. <gasps> oh, my knee. Coachella who? <laughs> Coachella but who? Oh, heaven. Literally my favorite thing. Good morning. <laughs> I'm here with Jay. Um, it is like 6 in the morning. I look horrendous right now. The but Respirez. Respirez, oh. baby. I... Yes, Respirez, but <laughs> we're in a line for TSA, so yeah. T minus four hours approximately until LA. Hey. But, yeah, I'm so excited. Let's get it. He's like, he has like a yay sticker in his, his luggage. Isn't that like the cutest thing? <laughs> He's like, yay. <laughs> For the last few days of Coachella, I didn't really get the opportunity to pick up my camera. Um, 
it was too fun of a trip for me to film everything. I had so much fun with all my friends, all the new, and there was just too much going on to pull out my vlog camera and just start filming, you know? But I did have a blast. Um, probably by the last day, my voice was pretty much gone and we we're just all exhausted. And it is now Wednesday. I don't know what specific number day it is, but it's Wednesday. I'm back in my apartment and I am just in recovery mode. Um, I did get a little slight tan to my face, kind of, but yeah, just rocking my new Coachella sweatshirt and just hiding at home, um, trying to catch up some work, trying to catch up on sleep, rest, and just kind of regain my uh, voice back. So yeah, looking a little gross here, but Coachella is very fun. Um, I went with Alba and her friends and they were just so much fun. I'm so glad that I went with them. Uh, this trip like easily made it to honestly like one of my favorite trips so far just because everybody got along so well there was like no bickering no arguments or no nothing really we all had fun and we all just like laughed at each other and laughed at stuff and we're just two together so yeah i love it when i'm able to do that and yeah i made up myself a lot of new friends and hopefully we all get to hang out again soon because i really enjoyed everybody's companies but yeah uh, vlog camera is about to die, so I'm just gonna peace out for now and until next time. Okay, bye. I get uh, what day is it? I don't even know what day is it. No, it's Earth Day, whatever number Earth Day is. Um, yeah, I've been a little MIA from the vlog lately, or just ever since I got back from Coachella. My brain cells have just, just you know, they're regrouping themselves. I definitely left a few back in Coachella Valley, but. You know, the surviving ones are still here and they're regrouping. It's Monday and I'm feeling a lot better than I did last week. Last week was just a whole complete blur. Um, this past weekend was 420 and Easter. So 420, you know, we did things. And then for Easter, we went over Jack's, um, which is Kevin's roommate's family's home for um, Easter brunch and that was super nice. This past weekend we also had our friend Abdullah and his girlfriend visit from Washington DC too and so we just, you know, did things. Um, after brunch yesterday we went down to the river in Fall City and you know just hung out by there for a little while. It was like super sunny so super nice and yeah we did that and after that we went to see the Snoqualmie Falls just because our friends don't get to see that much nature over in DC so took them out and did some naturey things and yeah yesterday just came home took a nap um, and now it's Monday and I have most of my work done um work is more work is coming in for the rest of the week so uh, there's that but I had coffee today I had very strong coffee today and I also yeah um I feel like I am on a caffeine overload right now because my head is pounding, it, my head hurts, and I'm just, I don't know, I'm feeling really anxious all day. So uh, yeah, caffeine does not mix well. I'm gonna try to pick up the vlog camera more often for this last kind of week of, um, is it March? It's April. That's the last week of April, so yes. Holding myself accountable to that, so let's do it. But right now, I feel like I am having a caffeine overdose. <sighs> yeah. So I'm still trying to eat healthy after Coachella. So lately, I've been making myself this super simple, kind of like, um, it's, it's vegan. Um, it's just a, well, I cannot talk today. But yeah, still trying to be healthy after Coachella. So I've been making myself this salad. It just has like iceberg lettuce, um, some romaine, uh, some butter lettuce with some strawberries, mangoes, and apple bits, and then poppy seed dressing. It's really good. Um, it doesn't really have any protein in it, but I didn't finish my salmon last week before I went to Coachella and I let it go to waste. So this week I'm punishing myself by not wasting food. So I just have this Nice little vegan salad, um, but yeah. It is April, April 24th, and I am up very early today because I have an orthodontist appointment. It is like seven, 
50 something and I am you know I have my makeup on and I am dressed that is a world record so for working from home I just wake up at 8 and then roll out of bed and you know start work at 9 but yeah I'm up extra early today because I have a ortho appointment at the University of Washington campus um, so yeah, I just kind of dressed like a, um, normal human being because the last few times I've gone in and got my braces tightened, I've looked like a homeless person in, like, sweats and leggings, uh, and Uggs. So yeah, I decided to, you know, look a little composed this time so that they don't think I'm just some bum. But yeah, I have on a made well kind of like turtleneck sweater. It's still pretty cold outside. Some jeans and I just threw on my trench coat. I'm still kind of debating on whether to wear this or not because it is a little like, it's a little too hot. It's, I don't know, it doesn't fit very well with the sweater. But I hear a voice crying for me. Who is it? Is it Banksy? Yes, baby. What can I do for you? Do you want your cat? Hello. Today we're getting one of my favorites, which is Indian buffet. <laughs> I am just freaking in love with naan. So, yeah. I'm in heaven right now. Is it good? Mm -hmm. All right, let's eat. Hello. It's the last day in April. I'm finally remembering to pick up the vlog camera. Um, so right now it is around 10 a.m. I am on my way to my car and then headed to my figure skating practice. But yeah, um, it's April, whatever the last day of the month is. Um, it's just been awful at picking up my camera this month. We've done a lot of things, but I don't know why I keep forgetting to pick it up. I literally bring my camera with me everywhere. Yeah, it might just been like a pretty busy month. And after just getting back from Coachella, I was just like, you know, feeling a little post-Coachella syndrome for like two weeks. Uh, the first week I got sick, and the second week I felt better, but I was still pretty out of it. But yeah, um, it's a Tuesday. Tuesdays are my favorite days because, I don't know, good things always happen on Tuesdays for me. Like Tuesday is the perfect day to like take the day off and run your errands because it's not Monday and everybody is like still at work. People are in school, you can go to the mall and run your errands without like any worries or like having to fight crowds or anything. So that's why I really like Tuesdays. Um, so yeah, I book my figure skating classes on Tuesdays and anything I like on Tuesdays. So Tuesdays is just really enjoyable for me. It's also a day where I take like on least work and just kind of like chill out and have a day to myself. Um, cause sometimes I do work on the weekends and sometimes I just need a day during the week just to, you know, feel, I don't know, I stare at the computer a lot for work so it's nice to give my eyes a break every once in a while and so it helps me not get migraines as well just cause I'm super, sen super sensitive to bright lights and any like blue lights that come from technology. Um, so yeah, when I'm not wearing my glasses or working a really long time, it's just nice to take a break. But no, I'm just rambling. Um, just letting my car warm up and then we're gonna drive to Kirkland to the ice rink. So, bye!